Eddie was real cool. He was really down to earth. He was always open to give advice, and he was he was super to work with too. He was really kind-hearted and and really true and very real in everything he said and did. Eddie was a guy who would just go in the ring and make it up as he as he went every step of the way, and that's why it was so fun to be in the ring with him because like you never knew what your final destination was going to be in the match. You know, you you would go in the ring and he he would go wild. And Eddie definitely worked on the fly, and he worked off the crowd. You know, if the crowd was red hot, you know, he would give them what they wanted when they needed If the crowd was dead and they were slow, he would take his time and he would build into what they needed to get that crowd into a frenzy. And Eddie was a master of understanding that, and he was a master of psychology from a standpoint of that you listen to what the crowd does and you gauge from the crowd at how you need to pace your match. He was just brilliant at that. And just the personality, he was truly the complete package. I was a fan, you know, I was a fan of Eddie Guerrero. And to know that I was actually going into a wrestling ring and having a super competitive match with him was such a compliment. I faced uh, Eddie in a King of the Ring qualifier match. It was always fun wrestling Eddie. The thing I'm sure in this match, as in all my matches with Eddie, we had our styles meshed very well because we both liked to move, we both liked to work, and, and we both hustle. So uh, th this match was like many of our others. It was a really fun match. Uh, really entertaining match and it was just it was for me it was an honor being out there with Eddie Guerrero.